I'm here with Chris Scott, owner of the Whistle Stop. There's a huge crowd out here today. Uh, the weather is stormy and the storm is upon us politically. Uh, what should people be doing at home, Chris, uh, to try and improve this situation that we find ourselves in? Well, they should be writing letters, they should be writing emails, they should be on the phone, they should be uh, getting the message out there to our elected officials that this stuff cannot continue, it's ridiculous. And uh, right now you're proposing to uh, run for the Wild Rose Independence Party. What, what brought you in that direction? Well, I, I know that we need big changes in our government and uh, originally I had encouraged people to renew their UCP memberships, um, get their voices heard within the parties, because that's what the party was supposed to be. When, when we formed the UCP, I, I was broke, but I did my part, I worked hard, I, I tried to get the message out there, we were successful, and I did it because I believed in a grassroots party that represented the membership. And we're not seeing that now. We're seeing Premier Kenny interfering on uh, C in, in CA meetings, um, threatening MLAs. Like it's just y you can't govern like that. And I really don't think any of this is going to change with the government like that. The problem is we have legislation in place that's allowing the government to circumvent our rights and freedoms, and we need to address that. And we need to, we need to do it quickly because it doesn't matter if it's COVID today. Or, or some other virus tomorrow, or a storm, or, or you know, UV rays, or whatever, whatever, whatever the reason is, they could just say you no longer have this right, and they can do it with a stroke of a pen, and that has to change. 